Good morning, we're so happy you're here. We daily vlog. We're daily vlogging for, what, like four more days? It is. It's yummy. It's yummy. That water is egg. All right, we're over in Claremont today to see Cousin Violet's softball games. This will be fun. Already, it's almost eight o'clock, but I finished the vlog. March 31st, cannot believe, so you can see I've been like editing in a file called 10 Days. And it's so fun that we get to vlog for 13 instead. Like a true millennial, I have multiple beverages with me. Um, what's crazy is today would have been our last day. And for that I'm extra thankful because I kind of feel like today kind of would have been a, a, f a flub of a, of a day to, um, to like finish off on. Um, I've learned like, it's been so cool to edit and to like to make ourselves do this and I, I've talked about this before um, and kind of like learned a lot even about like our schedule and maybe what could work um, Peter and I still have to like basically we said like we would do this and like have a talk and like kind of just gauge and see like what else we want to do we obviously have Disneyland vlogs coming and we're gonna prioritize those um, before we put up a birth vlog in a couple of weeks for mr. Charlie um, but again like I just always like I want to say thank you for so many reasons but especially just the response we had for fundraising for ACS to get these vlogs up just like made us feel so loved and that like we know how much we love the vlog and it's just so, I don't know, heartwarming to know that you guys do too. And that was really nice. And it just, I don't want to be emotional, but it just made us feel good. And it made us feel loved. And yeah, the vlog um, means a lot to us. And that's, that's where I'll leave it. I just realized I did a terrible job vlogging while at Violet's game. Uh, Violet did incredible. She's an amazing softball player. Um, Sarah stayed home to edit the vlog and to relax some. It's, you know, it's tiring. She's getting very late into this pregnancy and it's a lot of work to cook such a perfect baby while taking care of other perfect babies. Um, so then I was chasing around uh, these two little guys with their cousins and Auntie Christina, Uncle Granty. Um, but we're heading home now. It's like 7.45. We'll see how the drive goes home. Should be smooth. Maybe somebody falls asleep. Maybe they don't. Just won't know until we know, right? But what a way is to, to spend our Monday night seeing our family play some sports. Hi, Mr. Hippo. Did you have fun at the softball game? Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. You have a good time? Hi, my name is Zebra. Uh. Welcome home. <laughs> Yeah. We're friends. Yeah, we're friends. Jamesy fell asleep on the way home from the softball game, but Teddy did not. I'm cleaning up the toys tonight while Peter puts down Teddy and there are just a couple like cute little scenes of just like a day well played again. Just look at this Lego setup. It's so stinking cute. And then we have Elsa and Elsa and Rex in the, the Sven sleigh. Someone was clearly doing some very intentional Chopping. I don't know. Stopping to like 
appreciate these little setups like makes this toy cleanup so much more i don't know maybe enjoyable is not the word no oh, it's it is enjoyable and look who's here to help me or at least keep me company what are you doing it's that time of year where evie gets allergies bad we're gonna get her a haircut so she'll be fresh for the new babe hmm less hair flying around right <laughs> otherwise evie's been doing good right yeah she's just as cute as ever thank you well it is definitely the next day um peter had a great time with the kids at the softball game i I had a nice relaxing night. I was able to take a shower. And then I watched a movie, which does not happen often. I watched Return to Me, which is one of my parents' favorites. It's set in Chicago. So you know that pulls at the heartstrings. Um, I don't know if you buy the title, Return to Me. After the song, it's it involves a heart transplant and involves uh, an Irish and Italian family. If you're interested in seeing it, um, it's on Amazon Prime. So it is set at like Lincoln Park Zoo and yeah, it's, it's a great movie. Again, like a movie that like my parents watched that like I don't know if I ever like truly sat and watched it and I did last night and it was, it was really nice and calm and nice end to the night. Um, However, we did not sleep well. And just because we didn't sleep well doesn't mean the night wasn't nice. But like looking like where we would have signed off, like I know too much about what happened after we would have signed off. So it's funny that this sign off is happening. I'll talk more about the night's sleep um, in tomorrow's vlog. But this is really kind of like a super low key vlog, kind of like recuperating from the Easter weekend and so um, I am happy that we have a couple of more days to vlog even though the boys are kind of sniffly we're kind of taking it day by day but um, we'll see we'll see where the next couple days it might just be home vlogs the rest of the time um, but we could be a little bit just more intentional with what we're filming last little updates but thank you so much for watching and it is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.